Hey guys, welcome to today's video. Today we're going to be looking at fitting an OSPW to an Ultegra R8000 rear mech. I've already disassembled the um, rear mech itself. This is the cage that came off it. To disassemble that, you need to undo this screw here with the screwdriver, and then the spring tension brings it around. Then there is a um, T10 screw that goes into the rear mech itself, which is what actually holds the mech itself. But you'll see how this all works in a second when we put the OSPW itself um, onto the onto the jockey amp onto the mech itself in a second. So this is what we're going to be putting on. It's the R9000 um OSPW system from Speed. There are four tension points here, um, all the way from high to low. This is the spring that comes off your rear mech. There is a plastic washer on here. This is to which is um, to stop any grime stuff going into the uh, mechanism itself. Quite easy, start off by putting the spring into it. Um, second from high is where we're going to be putting this one, and then make second from low. We'll move to second from high, and um, that's where we'll put it for now. You can adjust it if you want uh, more cable tension or less cable tension, that's how you kind of um, adjust that using that. What is next? You line up the spring and the uh, washer itself to the mech, and you pop that through there. That will just slide straight on when you get it in line, and just yeah, make sure that plastic washer is um, in line as well as you push down. Now, I will say this is much easier to do when the bike is the mech is on a bike. For the next point, you'll see in a second after I screw back in the uh, T10 screw. Just check the spring tension is working as it should do on here. But then, as I say, what we'll do, we'll put in the T10 screw, and this will sit on here and hold the OSPW onto the mech. Um, it isn't actually a massively long thread, so don't worry too much, it will, won't take too long. It is a th um, quite a thin sort of um, area to actually get some bites on the tool itself. But uh, here you go, so you screw in the mechanism itself, and let's say that just holds that OSPW actually onto the um, mech itself just make sure we're nice and tight here before we move on a couple of turns here there we are cool so we're nice and tight there so now again i always like to check the spring to make sure it's all working as it should so there you go you've got the spring spring moving there so this is what we're looking like at the moment it looks a bit odd still because we need to now this is when it's easier it's on the bike itself you have to manipulate the mech around itself make sure the spring's right so move it forward like this and then you're about to see with my uh, skills trying to put it all together here so then you find a little retaining metal bolt use a two and a half mil allen key um, and you'll screw into the hole which will exactly what will hold um, the OSPW into its normal place with its spring tension on there so here we go as you can see here screw on the end screw straight into here nice and easy don't over tighten it because it is going into carbon and will break it but nice simple there we are in and then release all the tension and there we are a OSPW on an Ultegra rear mech all working as it should spring working fine shifting working fine and then there we are and then size the chain as you usually would so hope you enjoyed this slightly different video than usual I'm just going through trying to do a bit more maintenance stuff if you like the video please subscribe comment and i'll do some more content relevant to this thanks for watching goodbye